If you guys like conspiracies, you guys know Alex Jones. Alex Jones is infamous to some, famous to others. Alex Jones had a crazy video that I remember as a kid, I used to always watch, be like, oh my God, this is insane. Him breaking into the Bohemian Grove. After escaping the sheriff's department, Mike and I traveled high into the hills to wait until dark in the beginning of the cremation of care ceremony. Before the cremation of care, all the Bohemian Club members begin a massive feast of revelry. That video to me was crazy, crazy, crazy. I actually seen there's been updates of people that went in today, but it still didn't hit like that Alex Jones video. Also, Alex Jones had a conspiracy about Sandy Hooks that didn't go too well, as he was sued, if you guys saw, for a whole bunch of millions. So again, so they found me guilty, the judge did, and, and now they're having their show trial, and they've made up all this imaginary money I have uh, when I'm in bankruptcy and I'm almost personally out of money. Uh, and so it doesn't matter. They do a $500 billion verdict, a $10 trillion verdict, a $50 million verdict. You can't get blood out of a stone. You can't get blood out of these granite steps right here. Depending on how, what side of the ball you stand on for Alex Jones and his conspiracies, you might love him, you might hate Me, I'm just a fan of conspiracies. I'm not going to lie. The Tupac's still alive. Did we land on the moon? And many others. Did, did Egyptians have electricity? Like, I just love those kind of thoughts. You know, those are one of those hit the blunt conversations. You hit the blunt watch it like, yo, it's possible. Was God an alien? Egyptian drawings and writing show like aliens and like a saucer, but was it really God? Just all those conspiracy theories, I find them as entertainment. Now, is there a hundred percent proof to anything that Alex Jones is gonna share in this video? No, not at all. I was just super curious to watch this, see what information he has. The title to this video is, is Joe Biden still alive? Conspiracy theory. Again, nothing is factual. It's just people putting weird things together and just coming up with an idea. But that's a wild, wild idea. I, I saw this theory floating around on Reddit, but is it true? Is there a possibility that Joe Biden is no longer with us? Let's see what Alex Jones has to say about this, then we'll come back and recap. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, we're on the way to 10,000 subscribers. We will be doing a giveaway at 10,000 subs. Also, if you want to see how a Trump MAGA rally is, we, we did a vlog in one like about two weeks ago in Doral, Florida. Go check that out on the channel. But let's get into this. You're about to see clips of me. You're about to see clips of me in the last month say that if they tried to kill Trump, they would also kill Joe Biden because he's Biden. been going against the deep state as bad as he is trying to stay in power and bucking their orders. Now, even Fox News this morning said, we want proof of life. Where's Joe Biden? He hasn't been seen in five days since he was in Vegas. And now Charlie Kirk, who has amazing sources inside law enforcement says, law enforcement tells him he had a medical emergency. They asked him on the 17th to block the roads for Biden in Vegas, but he didn't go to the hospital they said he was gonna go to. And they put him on a plane and flew him out to a- Got a weird lead on a story that people should look into. I got a call from sources close to Las Vegas Metro. The official story was Joe Biden's trip was cut short last week due to COVID. However, according to this source, U.S. Secret Service informed Las Vegas Metro that there was an emergency situation invol involving Joe Biden. Closed necessary streets so that POTUS could be transported immediately to University Medical, which they began to do. Then, mysteriously, there was a stand down order, and the USSS informed local Vegas PD that they were going to they were going to medvac. I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly, at John Hopkins, which they presumed meant fly him back east ASAP. Apparently the rumor mill and the police departments that Joe Biden was dying or possibly already dead. I didn't think too much about the lead, seemed too wild to be true, but given that Joe Biden has been out of public sight for days and has dropped out of the race via an ex post, you're right. We haven't seen him talk about dropping out the race. That nigga tweet, uh, unless I missed it, unless I missed it, but how I got informed was him putting out a tweet. That's wild. I didn't think of that. Like, you wouldn't do a press conference or something like that. Like, that's not something you, you talk about everything else in the world. You wouldn't want to do a press conference to stand in front of the country and tell them, yo, you know what? I think it's best I probably stand out of this and put somebody else for the Democrats to represent the party. Just randomly, like, you know what? I know I've been saying that there's no way that I'm getting out of this race, but I woke up today and I thought about it. I'm gonna get out the race, actually. Like, man, we've been seeing him like, there's no way, Jose. I'm back up in this. I'm never gonna get out of this. They're gonna have to take me out of here, out of this earth for me to get out this race. Somebody was there like, oh, word? Oh, word? All right. Again, this is all alleged. We're just reading rumors online. Once again, Still, this still is the current president. So this is just rumors about the current president. He still is our president until November. And I feel like he jinxed himself, too. Remember a couple weeks ago, he was like, I saw a clip a couple weeks ago. I don't know exactly when he said it, but I saw a clip a couple weeks ago. And he was like, you know, I'm not getting out the race. The only way I'll get out the race is if I got an illness. Family members that would make him reevaluate staying in the race. If there had some medical condition that emerged, if somebody, if the doctors came to me and said, you got this problem. Oh, 
God. Why? I saw another clip of when he first got into office. Like, yeah, bro. You know, if I ever fell out with the people that, you know, got me there in the first place, just say I got an illness or something and jump out the race or jump out of office. Like, oh. And I, like I told Barack, if, if, if I reach something where there's a, a fundamental disagreement we have based on a moral principle, I'll, uh, I'll, 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 I'll develop some disease and say I have to resign. Um, we, we don't have that. I'm a, we haven't, and we just. Oh, wow. Wow. I'm telling you, this is, I think my life might be the Truman Show. I be having to call my friends sometime to make sure they're experiencing the same thing as me. Like, yo, I'm not, this is not the Truman Show, right? Like, just making sure, because life just really got crazy. Life just really got crazy. And his brother James indicated health was a factor. I'm beginning to grow more curious if COVID or something else has been more serious than reported. If anyone with Las Vegas Metro has information, please email freedom at charliekirk.com. I want to hear here there is more to the official story than what they are telling us that's crazy that is a wild that is a wild thing that is a wild thing most thing that stood out to me of all was that was not even i was just more shocked that he jumped out the race but yeah like we never heard him talk about it he just gave us a post a military hospital on the east coast now ladies and gentlemen joe biden after an attempted assassination of trump and all of this has now not been seen then you get his brother coming out and saying he wants him to enjoy whatever time he has left you have the signatures that were put out with no government letterhead, no U.S. seal, no presidential seal that do not match at all. If you came in with a bank signature, they check the signature card, they would decline the check. And you add to all of this the craziness of them trying to install Kamala Harris, Hillary Clinton jockeying for positions of power. This is insane. I'm not saying President Biden is dead. I'm asking, is he dead? Alex Jones learned his lesson. Alex Jones learned his lesson. Yo, I'm, hold on, hear me out. Like, you see how I've been saying that eight times? I don't know nothing. Hear me out. I'm not saying he's dead. I'm just asking a question. That's all I'm doing, just asking a question. He sat with some lawyers. Let's just say that he learned his lesson. And nigga asked some questions. All right, so for my next video, all right, how should I put that statement out? Is he in a coma? Again, I'm not saying he's dead. I'm asking, is he in a coma like Woodrow Wilson was for six months and his wife was really the president back in 1913, the guy that gave us the Federal Reserve, the IRS, and all the rest of it. This is the time of coups. This is the deep state desperate, the bureaucracy, to keep control of America. And Biden wasn't following their orders. He was an evil globalist, but he wasn't following their orders. And Trump is totally against him. He's had a failed assassination attempt against Trump. You had a secret service stand down, all the experts saying two shooters. This is such an insanely dangerous time. God, this is crazy. All jokes aside, if something like this could even be real, ta I'm, I'm telling you, I'm just gonna take my time and move to Montego Bay and live the rest of however long we got right there on the on the beach selling coconut drinks, selling coconut tequilas that I be making, like a little mixed drink. Woo Put all my savings in like a nice little shack. I don't know the name of it yet. Or let's let's get to shacking. I don't know. I'm gonna think of something creative though. I'm gonna think of something creative. Cause this is just looking crazy. This is just looking wild and the world is looking scarier and scarier day by day. Does Alex Jones have any merit to this story? He did give a lot of different things that I was like, oh, oh, signatures not matching. Oh, they said on Twitter, you know what? I actually changed my mind. Oh, his brother came out and said, yeah, we don't know how much longer he has on this earth. Let's just make sure that, you know, he enjoys his time. Oh. Is he dead? We don't know. But could he be real sick? Cause they said he had COVID a couple weeks ago and then we just stopped hearing about it. Totally. Breaking news, President Biden has tested positive for COVID. The president was expected to give the keynote speech at the Unidos U.S. conference in Las Vegas this evening. Unidos U.S. is the largest Latino-centered civil rights organization. We just stopped hearing about it totally. We just been hearing Kamala Harris, Kamala Harris, Kamala Harris, Kamala Harris. And all I keep thinking about is Donald Trump saying, and laughing Kamala. That's all I just, I just keep seeing that in my head. But all jokes aside, you know how scary this really is if there's any truth to this story at all? They come out later like, you know what's crazy? He's actually not here no more. Oh my God. We never see Joe again or they give us AI Joe. Bro, they've been showing us mug shots. Mug shots. Moving. All they got to do is add a voice to that and make one of his pictures do that. If they can make mug shots, make snakes appear, rats appear. But let me know down below. This just opens up a whole bunch of thoughts in my head. What do you think about what we heard in this video? Is there any truth there? Is there any possibilities? We have a whole bunch of other conspiracy videos regarding Joe Biden and our channel. We had another one that you guys actually liked that it did way better than I expected. Another one just, I hit the blunt and just saw the caption. I was like, I gotta click through. It was like, yo, is, is Joe Biden have a stunt devil? Like, cause they said that it looked like a mask that he had on with makeup and he took like certain shots. Just saying, we don't know if it's a makeup. I'm not a makeup artist. I never put makeup on in my life. But all I'm, I'm doing is I'm pulling the Alex Jones. I'm asking a question i'm just asking the question where is he? where is he and is it possible if they're doing that with mug shots and ai can they do it with our president and give us a fake video of him speaking you guys let me know i don't know i'm, I'm asking you We're on the road to 10,000 subscribers man sub up
since you dropped out of the race, sir. How are you feeling about Harris's campaign? Can Harris beat Trump? Can Harris beat Trump, Mr. President? Yeah, can Harris beat uh, Trump was the question at the air. The question's much more audible than the, what he had to say, but uh, I think I, I, he was saying feeling well or, uh, to that effect. But nothing substanti uh, substantial from... I, I've I, been in... I've been in the position of those reporters where you're desperately trying to lure him over to speak at greater length, but yes. it didn't work for them on that occasion. Well, they do when they want to.